Uh, we're here at the, with First Beat. So who are yes. you? So my name is Aki Pulkinen. I'm the uh, business director for the consumer licensing at First Beat. So what do you do at First Beat? Uh, physiology, insights on stress, recovery and exercise. What's going on here? Yeah, so we turn heartbeat data into meaningful insights on stress, recovery, exercise effect and fitness. So that's our core. And, uh, so you take the data from the, the smart devices, fitness devices? And yes. you, you make meaning out of it? Yes, that's, that's, that's our core. So we operate in professional sports, consumer products, and in wellness coaching. And uh, for example, in consumer products, we license the technology for these brands like Sony, Microsoft, uh, Garmin. And this is one of our recent devices that came up like, like uh, a month or a couple of months ago by Sony. So we license technology here. It, the, the, this SmartMan 2 measures the heart rate there, heart rate variability optically from the optical sensor. And uh, our software runs in the device and uh, turns that heartbeat data into, for example, my stress levels. So you can see here that I was sleeping like a baby last night. And then I came here uh, to the conference and I had some stress, but it's okay. So I indicates me that I'm ready to give the pitch. So how's your software on this device? What is the Cortex M0 or a very low power and uh, you have software on the device? Yes. Is it important? You have to be in the device? Well, uh, in the device you have all the data available, so it enables a very efficient power schemes, like, like if you can calculate everything on the device, so you don't ha have to transmit the raw data, for example, to the cloud. So it enables like, a, so it's pretty efficient. So, uh, because for example, if you have heart rate monitoring, yeah. you need to monitor the heart at the right frequency or something to make it sense out of it? Or what's the point of your software being in the device? Well, software point of being device is that like, uh, uh, so if you don't have, for example, your phone with you, so it enables a real time feedback, for example, like if you do it, do it on the device. Of course, it could be run in the, in the app, in the, in the uh, phone or in the cloud, wherever, but uh, typically the model is that like, like to run it on the device. So, for example, the Garmin devices, you can see on real time how your performance behaves across your workout. So, so heart, heart rate variability is really important? Yes. So heart rate variability is the core, so the variance between the heartbeats. So of course, like with the uh, introduction of the optical sensors, we don't always get the heart rate variability. We get only the heart rate level, but that enables, in any case, the providing the exercise metrics, via 2 max and and, and, and training effects and stuff like that. So there's lots of uh, 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 wearables that measure maybe the steps and other stuff. Yeah. But it's not very useful if you don't show people how to have a better life, right? You have to coach them. And that's the most important ingredient is what you're doing, like making sense yeah. out of this data, right? Yes. So I think like, like it's exactly like as you said. So like uh, if you have only the data, so that's not meaningful, but it's good that you have the data so you can turn that through analysis to a feedback to you. So and the feedback then you can turn into an advice. So you can cannot jump into conclusion, so to say. But you, if you have the physical analysis there, so you understand what's happening in the body. So then you can provide the feedback, which is truly accurate and, and uh, personal for the people. Right. So a lot more is going to happen in the future. Where are you based? We are based in Finland. Yeah. And uh, busy? Yeah. <laughs> well, you saw my stress levels. <laughs> You, I saw what? The you, stress levels. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So stress levels going up? Yeah, definitely. Which can be okay. It is okay, but well, half a year still for the summer leave, so <laughs> have to start struggle until that time. Yeah.